I'm inspired by bright colors, graphics, texture. I love that as an adult, I can still play in the mud like a child. I'm Nancy Maripod, a senior executive assistant in the president's office in Atlanta, and I make pottery. I took my first class when I was in high school. I went to a local YWCA. and I took a few classes there, but I'm mostly self-taught. Once I graduated from college, I didn't really do much in art, and then I became a mother. And when we went to sign my son up for karate classes when he was in elementary school, at the same time, they had pottery classes. So I thought, well, I'm not taking time away from him. It's OK. But that was it, I was stuck. I do both wheel thrown, which is done on the pottery wheel, and hand built. Hand built pottery is uh, pottery that you do either rolling out clay or manipulating it in some way. Sometimes you can put it over forms. Wheel thrown pottery is when you use a potter's wheel. It does a much more uniform shape than doing hand built pottery. I love starting with a piece of clay, and it's a blank slate, and it's up to me to bring it to life. When I start out, say I'm doing a hand-built piece, I try and decide what I'm gonna do with it. Is it gonna be a large piece? Is it gonna be a small piece? What different pieces of lace or texture am I gonna use with that piece? I've thought about every bit of it. Over my lifetime, I've made thousands of pieces. I can't really put a finger on it. I've made everywhere from large decanters, large vases, large bowls, down to small little Christmas ornaments. And I'll even take little spare pieces of clay and turn them into magnets. When I taught my classes at the recreation center, I used to call it Thursday night therapy because it's extremely therapeutic. It's just fun to play in the mud. My pieces all are very time consuming, <laughs> probably at least a week to do from beginning to end. So you can't rush the process. I have my own home studio. I have a large slab roller, which is like a, a huge table that will evenly roll out slabs of clay. I also have my own potter's wheel. I go to a local potter studio and they do all my firings for me. I currently am doing juried shows. I've been doing fired works, and I've also been doing Fire and Ice, which is a show that they do for Christmas, a holiday show, which is done by the Making Arts Alliance. Right now I'm making lots of Christmas trees, lots of ornaments, and different bowls and pieces. I really enjoy sharing my work with others. I actually received a text from one of the people who had purchased one of my pieces, and she took a picture of my piece in her kitchen. Getting a response like that is worth more than gold. So <laughs> it's nice when you share your art with the world and it's appreciated.